What's up guys and welcome back once again to another Random Tuesday and today guys for Random Tuesday we are playing a demo now this demo is called Beholder um, it is about a world where government basically controls everything and um, as being such they employ people within a community to be their eyes and ears and this here is about a landlord who is to be the eyes and ears of the government and um, it's your job to spy on tenants to do certain things to report back to the government so um, without any further ado guys let's get into this game and, and see what this is all about huh dear Carl Stein we are happy to announce You've been appointed the landlord of a Class D apartment block on Krushvitska 6. You must go there immediately and begin working. We have given you and your family an apartment on the first floor. The experimental drug we injected into your system during your medical exam suppresses your need for sleep. Thus, you will be able to spend more time serving your motherland. Welcome to the elite official rank. Ministry of Allocation. Dear Carl right. Stein, we are happy to announce you've been appointed a landlord of the Class D. And now, now they read it. Okay, I, I went through all that. Six. For what? For what? I think I read it better. Yes. You must arrive there immediately and start working. Whoa. You and your family are given an I'm getting manhandled over there. The Is that my kid? Is that my kid? The experimental medicine you've Ooh. been injected what? with during the what? medical checkout suppresses your need for sleep. Why are they beating Thus, me up? You will be able to spend more time serving your motherland. Oh yes. Serve your motherland. What? They beat the crap out of me. Um, injected experimental drugs into my system. And basically making me be their servant. Alrighty. Okay. We're home, guys! We're home! What? Okay, so that wasn't me. That's me. Okay. Now somebody else getting beat up. Okay. Welcome to the Elite Official Rank. Ministry of Allocation. Okay. Well, then. Alright, so here we are. Um, new government directive received, okay, it says, this is your boss, click on him to begin talking. When there is a exclamation by an NPC, he or she has a quest for you. Alright. <clears throat> you must be Carl. Good afternoon. Mohaha, monocle, 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 mohaha. On behalf of the Ministry of Order, I welcome you to your new position. <laughs> uh, what's going on, dude? We're driving pests out of the house. It's of no concern to you. Object or agree? Object or agree? Object. I can't turn a blind eye to a person being removed from the apartment in which we're going to live in handcuffs. Good. Your task is to keep your eyes and ears wide open. Your predecessor was unable to cope with the easiest tasks. Everything your tenants do is your business. And the word everything means exactly? The word everything means absolutely everything. Okay, so that's completely disturbing. You will follow their every step and document any suspicious activity. Monocle, monocle, monocle. 
That is, if you want to earn a reputation for being a good public servant. If that's what it takes to be public service, I, servant, I don't want to be a public servant. If you're going to be a perfect beholder, document hobbies, interests, and every conversations, and even conversations, how can I do this? Observe and record. Surveillance cameras will help. Let's start at the beginning. Have you ever managed an apartment building before, Carl? Do you need my help? Um, alright, let's go through with the tutorial. Let's, so we can see everything in this demo. I need your help. <clears throat> I'll help you, but keep your eyes peeled and don't miss a thing. Here's your duty journal. It's located on the right side of the screen. Okay, so that's all of this. Alright. Scroll through the tabs and take a look at it. Oh, okay. So that's tasks. So, like, talk to your boss. It's a task, okay. Profile, basement, apartment one, apartment two, apartment three, and then vacants. Okay. Government directives. Okay. Prohibited. Punishment for violation arrests. Hiding information about crimes or killing. Fines are green and apples. Okay. <clears throat> and this is, I don't know. It doesn't say what that is. Okay, so. Then we'll continue our talk. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, 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 dot. Oh. According to our documentation, your predecessor received two of them. So, the violations, I'm guessing. Find them in your office, which is to the right of this room. Okay, so I'm wondering... Oh, okay, wow, I can move the camera, alright. Alright, okay, okay, so this is definitely interesting. Um, search? Two cameras, oh, okay, so it was cameras he was talking about, alright. Take and take, okay. Alright, yep, and it says to go back to my boss. Alright, so I gotta come back here and talk to my boss again. Great! You found the cameras! Install them in the dining hall. Follow me! Okay. Well, I got used to this, uh, this camera setup here. It is, uh, sensitive. It says click on the smoke detector, then choose a camera to install. Click on the basket to remove the camera. Yes, I magically made the camera appear there. You know, I didn't even reach up for it, no grabbing a ladder. I'm just I'm 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 magic like that. Set up surveillance camera. This is important. I did. You'll have to do this over and over. Otherwise, you'll never learn what your tenants do. Okay, so I can choose to say I don't want to or end the conversation. Um, let's say I don't want to. That's a strange claim. Are you sure you want this job? If not, you must leave before you and your family unpack your things. But your previous position is already occupied. The Ministry of Distribution doesn't have another job for you. So move past your objection and install the camera. I've already installed it though. Set up a surveillance cam camera. This is important. In the conversation. Okay, so I already did that. Oh, install security. I get installed too? Oh, there we go. Here's the second one. Okay, so I got installed two. That's Ascension. Install two cameras. Got it. Got it. Okay, so now I get to go talk back to my boss again. You're doing fine. Here's your first reward. Um, wait, I get a reward? Whoa, money. Monies. 
Spend your money on the things you need. You'll find them at the shop. You'll receive surveillance cameras as you earn reputation points. <clears throat> okay. Alright. Reputation points show your reputation. You receive them for completing tasks. You can also use them for personal gain in order to persuade the people around you to do what you want them to do. Okay, so already I see about this game. I'm basically spying and I am bribing people by saying, hey, you can be an established member of the community. I'll give you some reputation if you do this tasks for me. So, definitely a corrupt society. Unfortunately, I have issues to deal with at the ministry. However, you can call me anytime from your office using your private line and ask me anything. By the way, Carl, I strongly encourage you to answer the phone. Remember, you and I serve our great people, and the completion of the directives and orders of the Ministry are our bread, water, and air. Here's the main thing, several tenants are at risk. Your predecessor couldn't handle things, we're hoping you'll do better. Just tell me how. First of all, watch the tenants closely. File a report as soon as you gather evidence. The police will take care of the rest. Okay, alright. Between ourselves, our great state can be very grateful to those who do their work well. The ministry can turn a blind eye to forgery and blackmail if you help. If they help you achieve your goal. What? Okay, so he's encouraging... Forgery and blackmail. What? <clears throat> okay, so I can say I'll do my best. This isn't what I was expecting from this job. If I were you, I'd be worried about whether or not you're satisfying the ministry's expectations regarding your position. Well, alright, dude. Be slow to call our department. You can always ask your wise tutor for advice. The keys I gave you open every door in the building. Make sure your tenants leave their apartment before you enter it. Many citizens still think their private life is their own business. Make sure it stays this way. Okay. <clears throat> New government directive received. Okay. Now get to work. Yes, sir. Yes, the phone's ringing. Okay, it says, um... My boss said to call the ministry to receive instructions. Call the ministry. Okay, alright, so now I gotta come here and use the phone. Ministry of Order, your call is accepted. Hello, Carl. You've learned your main duties. Are you ready to receive a task? Sure, why not? Establish surveillance, surveillance in apartment 2. Jacob Manischek lives there. You can always buy the cameras you need at the state shop. Only enter a tenant's apartment when they're not home. And be careful. Okay. So it says use... Oh, the mouse to... Oh, just the scale. Well, that's a lot easier. Okay, search apartment 2. Install a camera in apartment 2. Gather data on Jacob Moonside. Okay. So how do I go to the store? Okay, so hold hold on here. I need I need to figure out how to buy a security camera because it says I need to install a security camera. Oh 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 guys. Okay, I see it. All right, so I can buy security camera. The store was right up there. Okay, so now which apartment is apartment number two? One two. This is number two. Gather data. Okay, so I I, I went away from the door because I don't know if this is. Is this the guy in apartment number two? No? Okay. What about this person? I don't know who that is. Good afternoon! Get acquainted. Hello, miss. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Carl. I'm the new manager of the apartment buildings. My name is Rose Rennick. It's nice to meet you, Sonny. You must have met my naughty husband already. <laughs> Why is he naughty? 
We have a son too. He's just like you, but he lives in the capital. Well then, all right. Um, you have a a a wonderful day, lady. And um, you know what? I hope your son has a wonderful day. Is this the guy that lives in apartment number two? If he is, then I need to wait until he's gone. Let's see where this guy goes. No, he does not live in apartment number two. Okay. Alright, so we're going to peek through here again. Okay, we're going to enter the... Enter now. Okay. Now we're going to leave. Okay, we're going to go back down here. Over here again. Okay. So we have a security camera installed. Alright, so... Oh, we didn't search the apartment, though. And gather data. Crap. Okay, alright. So we've got more that we need to do. Oh, man, I'm so creeper status. status. Okay, nothing. Search this apartment. I'm, like, so afraid that this, is, this person's gonna come home. While I'm searching the place. Okay, nothing there. Search the chair. Nothing. I think I already searched the bookshelf. Okay, search the uh, little table. Attention, people who steal the belongings of others will be prosecuted under law. To collect information or evidence, click on the colored text in the object description. Okay. Alright, so instead of stealing it, I, I use it to collect information. Oh, there's somebody coming this way. Crap. Please don't be coming in here. Don't come. Okay. Oh, he's not coming. He's not coming in here. Go, 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 go. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. Okay. Okay, so they didn't see me. All right. Okay. Call the ministry to report the completion of your tasks. Okay, all right. So I've completed the tasks they asked me to do. I gathered information on the guy and I installed a security camera. Oh, is that him? That's him. Watch. Oh, crap. I left just in the nick of time. Ministry of Order. Congratulations. Your first task was a success. You're, you are rewarded. 500 plus 50 reputation points. Okay, so I got $500 plus 50 reputation points. According to our sources, Jacob Manischek is violating state directives. Spy on him using the surveillance cameras. When a camera detects a tenant doing something illegal, the action icon changes color. Click on the icon to add the evidence to the dossier. Okay. Attach the evidence you gather to your report. Alright, it says, I must gather evidence on Jacob Manischek before in being involved in criminal activity and then report it. Oh. Oh, man. This is getting so, like, questionable. There. Okay, so move the evidence you collected to the evidence field. It will be used after you send the information. Okay, so it, I actually have to put the date and everything. Wow, this is pretty intricate. Okay, so it is 4 9 84. Evidence found in the apartment. Okay, drag collected materials here. Oh, there's an objective thing there. What are you doing in there? What do you want? Okay, so get acquainted. Who are you? Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Carl. I'm the new manager of the apartment buildings. Did I win a competition called Who Gives a Damn About the New Manager? I don't... 
I don't care about you and your deals. Okay, alright, fine. It's my duty to look after this apartment building. Watch yourself. It's not as if nothing bad could happen to your family. Okay, so this guy is like legitimately a scumbag, but I feel like it's still wrong what I'm doing here. Okay, so Death and Needle. Charlie Smith, the son of a miners trade union leader, was found unconscious after criminals reportedly pumped him full of drugs. He's being treated and rehabilitated at the hospital. The Ministry of Order advises citizens to be alert and interfere with any attempts to manufacture and spread drugs. Remember, your child could be next. Voice of Truth. The drugs are a huge problem in our society. We should have started dealing with them a long time ago. Not wait for a VIP to get in trouble. By the way, this isn't the first time Charlie Smith has been at the center of a scandal. Was he really a victim? Okay, alright, so... Oh, okay. You know what? Oh, it's this one right here. Okay, so I can drag... There we go! I figured it out. So you have to actually click on the person, and then you drag what you've collected over there. Okay. So... Okay, you know what? We'll just, um... We'll go ahead and send that. I do have evidence of that, so... Okay, so the report on Tenant Jacob Manasek has been sent to the police. The police went to the apartment building to investigate. Okay, so... Oh, here they go! Here they come, here they come. Alright. Oh, they just knocked the door straight down. What are they gonna do? 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 Oh! 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 Well, I mean, I mean, granted, he was making drugs, and he did threaten my family. Um. Oh man! But do they treat everyone like that? Oh man. Okay, so I can see that this is gonna be like a moral dilemma type game. Where whether or not whether I feel it's um, correct or not, should I report it and sh or should I not? Because I'm sure there's going to be minor violations like wearing old clothes is considered a violation, and they could probably get this treatment if I report them, or I could choose to not report them. So okay, so he's getting put right into the back of the um, the police van right now. Oh wow. Okay, so I'm at a thousand fifty dollars. Okay, and that apartment is now vacant. New government directive. Okay. So, so now, I must repair the apartment following Manasek's arrest and find a new tenant. Repair cost 750 Okay, so I did that. Leaving me with only $300. Okay, so now I need to find a tenant. I wonder if any of these guys hello sir hello um hello sir would you would you like to um would you like to live here um we're gonna choose this guy because he kind of looks like the state puff marshmallow man oh my god he does too he straight looks like the state puff marshmallow man oh my gosh oh my gosh da -na -da -na -da -na -na -da -na da -na -da -na -na I ain't afraid of no ghosts. <laughs> okay. My camera's still in there, too. Okay, Daily News. The Ministry of Truth has noticed an increasing interest in philosophy books, including the works of Paul Williams, who died a century ago. His writings describe obsolete ideas that have been proven to be unrealistic. However, they still capture people's minds. The ministry believes the notion of a society without government in which the freedom of personal choice exists is dangerous and should be destroyed in all its forms. Okay, so they're basically protecting their, their philosophy with this and forcing that protection. Now, the fact that our society is capable of understanding Paul Williams' ideas in mass proves him unique ta a unique talent an ability to to word things simply we should encourage interest in the great thinkers of the past if we want to progress and initiate a dialogue between the people and the state philosophy is nonsense okay so with each letter I get what the government tells you and what the people 
like I was saying, there's like a secret society. So imagine this is like, um, like some uh, activist group that sends this out with everything on the back. So, all right. My family is in dire need of my attention, it looks like. What, Carl? Talk about work. Are you happy with your new job, Carl? I haven't done anything yet, honey. I saw the police march and handcuffed person r right by me. It scared me. Who was that, Carl? The previous building manager. He didn't handle his duties well. What a nightmare. Carl, couldn't the same thing happen to you? Don't worry, honey. I'll be a good manager. So, um, domestic problems. I need your help, honey. I can't find a big enough saucepan. I searched every nook and cranny and have no idea where it is. Maybe someone stole it. Should we call the police? Call the police because of an old saucepan? Don't even think of this. You must have left it in our old house. Okay, if you say so, can I ask the tenants about the saucepan? I hope they won't reject the new manager. I'll make a uh, compote for Martha and bring it back. Okay, I'll ask the neighbors about the saucepan. Oh my god. Okay, so not only do I get objectives from the government, but I'm going to get objectives from my family as well. Oh, and speaking of the government, I have a new objective here. So, Ministry of Order. Congratulations, your task was a success. As a reward, we are transferring the following sum to your account. $1,000 and 250 reputation. What? Okay, so... If I'm off searching someone's apartment and that phone rings, I have to leave and get back here. Otherwise, I will be fined. Wow! Talk with Shimmer's wife, talk with Mark Rannick, and talk with Rosa Rannick. Okay, so I, I have a few people that I have to speak with. But first, before I do that, I feel like I should um, speak with my daughter here. I don't know what she's doing in the dark all by herself over here. What are you doing? Will you play with me? Not now, Martha. Okay, so she has a lost toy. What happened, sweetheart? Something bad happened, Dad. I lost Nara. It's nowhere to find. Who's Nara? It's my doll. It's my favorite doll in the whole world, Dad. Will you help me find it? You scared me, Martha. Where did you last play with it? At home. Nara is too small to walk outside. Find her, please! Okay, well then. Hey, hey, angsty teenager, come here. Okay, end dialogue. Angsty teenager, what do you want now? Yes, fa- Yes, father! What? He really is- He really is an angsty teenager. I have an issue, father. What do you want? Economics class started, and we're given the, a list of books to read. The books I need for school. I went to the bookshop, and they don't have these books. My friends say antique dealers sell these books at the market on Saturday, but they cost a fortune. Can you ask your friends? Perhaps someone you know has these books? You talk to wise people. I'm thinking about what I can do for you. Is that Maria Shimmer? I think that's Maria Shimmer. Come on. Dude. Okay, so I should ask about the husband first. How is your husband doing? He looked upset. He doesn't feel well. He received a parcel containing a reel of film. Claus likes taking photos. This will cheer him up. Okay, I want to talk to you again. Hello? Okay, ask about the saucepan. Can you do me a favor? Can I borrow your saucepan? My wife wants to make a compot, but we lost our saucepan while moving in. I have a suitable saucepan. Here it is. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you. I'll bring her... We'll bring her back. There's no need for this. My husband and I live alone. 
and we don't even touch this. Please accept this as my housewarming gift. All right, okay, so I've acquired a saucepan, so we're gonna take the saucepan back to the wife. And we did get some information, I think that was on, yes, we did talk to his wife. Okay, so, woman, why? Why can I not just talk to you? Crap. I have this, this saucepan. Okay, all right, well, let's look at our tasks since, since she doesn't want to talk to me right now. Talk with Mark Rennick and Rosa, Rosa Rennick. I want to speak, I, wa I want to ask you about Claus Shimmer. Does he bother you? He's a person of worth. He helped me to acquire a nice bottle of Zerus. He's an expert in wine, unlike my grandpa. Okay, so I got a little bit of reputation. Hey, 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 hey! Crap. Found the doll. Okay, I got it. So now, let's go talk to my daughter. My loving little daughter here. <laughs> Wait, will you play with me, Daddy? Not now, Martha. Okay, but I have your doll. What's your doll's name? I miss Naria so much. Will you find her? I already found her. Here she is. Thanks, Daddy. I thought of a great game. Want me to tell you about it? Naria will be a miner buried under rubble. And I'll be the rescuer. What a game. Maybe you'd better play with blocks. <laughs> That's a little horrifying, dear. Just a little bit. <clears throat> I'll build a coal mine out of a letter blocks. Okay. You do that, you creepy little kid. There he is. Okay. How did it show him go through the door? Oh. <sighs> Maybe he came back. Maybe he took the bus out of town or something like that and then came back. So we're going to talk to him now and see what he has to say. What do you want from the archivist? Okay, so ask about Claus Shimmer. I want to ask you about Claus Shimmer. What do you, why do you want to know? He looks so crazy. Um... Give a vague reply. I don't know anything you don't know. Moreover, curiosity is a terrible sin. I had a co-worker who was always poking his nose into other people's business and documents. Okay, so let's ask what happened to him. He was sent to jail. You've learned more than you have to. Goodbye, young man. Okay, it says I must write down Claus Shimmer's characteristics. Okay, so I have to do a profile. I believe so. So we're going to go back to my office. And we're going to write a profile, a characteristics profile. Claus Shimmer. Okay, and then uh, um, living in apartment number one he's male marital status he's married to Maria Shimmer okay so I have those is he really unemployed though oh he's a tobacco salesman it says it right there okay so tobacco salesman and then send that profile okay good oh and I made money off of that okay Ministry of Order. Time to act, Comrade Carl. You must evict Claus Shimmer. What? What will happen to his wife? We don't care about her. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I feel like. Oh, man. Because I could be. I could be making them homeless. Oh no! Do what you think is best. Oh! How can I evict him? Talk with Shimmer. We'd be fine with him moving out. 
It'd be better if you report him when he violates the directives. This is your duty, Comrade Carl. I understand. Talk with you later. Oh man, I feel so bad because the Shimmer Lady gave us the saucepan. She was super nice to us. And, um, and he's just trying to make ends meet because they kind of screwed him over by taking this apartment building from him and seizing it for a government asset and then putting other people in charge. But he's the ex-owner. Oh, oh man, I can't, I can't do it guys, I can't do it. Oh, well guys, if you guys want to see me um, play more of this video and see what happens, or this game and see what happens next, um, this is just a demo. Um, if you guys like this, really like this game, then I'll consider possibly getting the actual version, and um, we can see how far this goes. But um, for right now, guys, if you like this video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, or if you're just playing new to my channel. Channel, uh, and as always, guys, stay awesome. I'm Dark J, and I'm out. Oh, look at him! Look at him! I am Mr. Robot. You are playing Magic Tycoon. Find them. Oh, awesome power of the combining gods. Hear my cry and make a big red crystal.